Hey everyone and welcome back to Style Savvy Fashion Forward. As you can see, we're still wearing this awesome pirate outfit. Because I just couldn't bring myself to change into something else. Plus, we didn't really wear it for very long. So, today we can actually do the fashion show because I sold all the tickets. But there is stuff going on over around the cafe, so I wanted to see what that was first. Because I don't know. I don't know what's going on here. Okay. So, we had this conversation before. So, we already did this. I'm really confused. Do I, does she have to see me in like a simple outfit again? Because we already did that. I don't know what that's about. What is going on in here? There's this group I really want in my venue, but I need some help with something. They're called the Stilettos, and they have this whole super heroine vibe going on. There are three of them, a red one, a blue one, and a yellow one. But that's the thing, at the moment, they all look the same. I can't even tell which is which. Do you think you could help? They're all so talented and they work really hard. So I'm sure they'll be an awesome group once their costumes are sorted. Please, I'm counting on you. The red one's called Ruby, the yellow one is Amber, and the blue one's name is Sapphire. You should find them all in the city somewhere, training no doubt. I'd really appreciate it if you could find them and give them some costumes in the right colors. Oh, okay. Um, that's a thing. Is one of them here, maybe? Who are you? Oh, that's... Okay, so that's Amber. Hi, I'm out of breath after that one. That last note, I just can't seem to get there. Maybe if I... Oh, I do apologize. I was in my own little world. Can I help you with something? Hold on. You wouldn't happen to be Kita by any chance. Keisha from the live music club called earlier to say you'd be coming. My name's Amber. I'm the yellow member of the Stilettos. I've been doing vocal practice. Would you mind maybe listening to some? I could use the feedback. Tra -la -la, and I'm free! So what did you think? Was I any good? Sure. You really think so? Thank you, thank you, thank you, thank you! I've been practicing so much I was afraid I'd lose my voice. Oh, I'm sorry, we were in the middle of talking about something else, weren't we? You're here to help me find a yellow costume for our performance, right? I'm not very good at picking out clothes. I've been concentrating more on my voice, to be honest. But I'm sure you'll find me something pretty. I'll try on whatever you pick. I just need a yellow top to match my character. If you don't have any, be sure to stock up. Okay. Can I give them actual costumes? Like from Purple Moon? Is that what I'm supposed to be doing, probably? Oh, here's a different one. Ugh, not quite there yet. I need a little more practice. I still can't quite get the rhythm right. Oh, hi there. Wait, you wouldn't be Kita by any chance. Keisha from the Live Music Club called ahead to tell me you'd be coming. She said you'd be helping us pick out new costumes for the Stilettos. My name is Sapphire. I'm the blue member of the group. I was just in the middle of practicing my dance moves. Here, I'll show you. Hey, hey. How was that? Did I nail it? <laughs> sure. Sure. You really think so? Yeah, I feel much better about performing on stage now. All that time spent practicing was worth it after all. Oh wait, you didn't come here to give me advice on my dancing, did you? You're supposed to be helping me pick out some blue to full clothes. Ha. Huh. I'll head straight to your boutique once I'm done here. Alright. So, I think I just have to give them shirts. I don't... I don't know. We can check purple moon and see if there's anything. Um, well, this is green. I might have that in yellow that I could give them. I don't know if I can give them, like, any shirt or if it has to be from Purple Moon. I don't know. But let's try to find the other person. You're not the other person. Mm, there you are. I can't stop yet, not until everything is perfect. Just a little more practice, a little more time. Uh, do you want something? Wait, are you Kita? I got a text from Keisha over at the Live Music Club. My name is Ruby. I'm the red member of the Stilettos. I'm just practicing my spin at the moment. Do you want to see it? Yeah. How was that? Did I do it? Yeah, it was great. Really, you mean it? 
All that practicing must have paid off. Oh yeah, I almost forgot why you came to see me. You're here to help me pick out a new costume, right? <laughs> I'm looking forward to seeing what you come up with. I'm still a student, so I'll only be able to afford one top. Please, I need your help. Counting on you. Uh-oh. I don't know if I do. I mean, I probably have a red top. But I don't, I don't know. I think I can check in the store. I think I can check my stuff. Yes, I can. I mean, I probably have, see there's the yellow one. Does it just have to be that color? Or does it have to be a certain style? That's what I'm not sure of. Hmm. Well, let's, let's see. All right. The red top fit for the stage. See, considering how much she's ready to spend, I wonder if I am supposed to give her that specific shirt. Probably, because I think that's the rest of the outfit. Um. Yeah, I don't... I think we're gonna have to wait. At least for her. I could... If the, if the yellow one were here, I could... There we go. We'll try that. We'll try to give her the yellow one and see if... See if that's what she's looking for. I'm assuming it is. All right, yeah, cause it's almost exactly a thousand. So I think this is what she's looking for. Yep. Well, that worked out for me. Thousand dollar shirt. Goodness. Oh. She wants her hair did. We can do that. She needs it, so. Oh, Jialing also came back, finally. Since she needs something dainty. All right, let's go do the fashion show. Oh, hello. Who are you? I don't know who that is. Should I know who that is? <laughs> Whoops. Okay. Let's open up the fashion show. Cool and sassy outfit. Perfect for summer. So I think we've been going for um, bold with this one. So I'll have to find something bold. All right, so here's what we're going with. We got this nice strapless dress and a necklace from Enid Chen and the shoes and the um, studded clutch are from AZ USA. So I think we're looking pretty cool and sassy. I'm gonna leave the hair the same. I would change up the makeup, but you can only pick from the sets and I don't really want to use any of those, so it's just gonna stay the same. All right, looks good. I still don't know who that is. <laughs> Some random person wearing bubble pants. I don't recall giving anybody an outfit for, uh, this fashion show, except for Callie. Who I didn't even see. <gasps> oh well. Work that expensive dress. 
Perfect. Sparkles. I wish they gave you different poses. There's only three. And they're kind of lame. <laughs> I just keep throwing like stars. not the best face for that. Alright. No, that's what I'd call a fashion show. You were a star out there. I think it might have been the best I've ever seen. No, really. I hope you'll tell me when the next one is because I'd hate to miss it. That was a first class show! You have such an amazing stage presence. Next time there's a show like that, you'll have to tell me immediately. I thought everybody knew. You would think everybody would know. A present. A cool frame. Sweet. So, I wanna see what we can choose from. I want one to be for costumes. I'd really like to do a costume fashion show. We have summer romance, summer music festival, summer sunshine, cool in summer, summer holiday love, and the stage is yours. Set the stage the way you like. It's your show and your rules. Oh, banana fashion show. It will happen. It will happen. Maybe I'll just pick that one now. Banana fashion show. Oh, we're gonna make a unique show. It's gonna be great. But that'll be later. Some other time. Wait, where did she go? Xiaoling was in here. Where did she go? Ruth. What the crap are you wearing, Ruth? Plays games on the train, often misses her stop. Well, that's good to know. I guess I'll give you an outfit and see if uh, she comes back. Marina, like Splatoon. A bold outfit, like the one from the fashion show. I'm assuming that because we just did the fashion show that a lot of people are going to ask for clothes that are in the bold style because that's what the theme was, so. How about a bikini top? How about this? I mixed uh, a little bit of Enid Chen with um, Izzy USA, because a lot of their stuff is technically bold, but it's a little bit more expensive. So, figured something summery. The bikini top, it's a leather one and it's gold, so. Dressed it up a little bit with a jacket. Boy. Captain Trash and set sail. There's Jelling. What up? Alright. Yes, we know you can't copy Callie forever. Yes, we already had this conversation. And I guess you have the girly style. Which I thought I would get to pick your style, but no, of course not. I don't even know what all I have in the girly style. Well, you're just gonna have to deal with it. All right, so here's what I put together for her. She doesn't really deserve a flower crown, but I guess I'll give her one anyway. 
Um, I didn't, I didn't really want to go with these shoes, but I couldn't really find other ones that matched perfectly because the tones of pink were off and then it just sort of looked weird. So we're going with these ones. You better like this. We will get in a fight. I kind of wish the, I had better matching flower crown, but... Whenever I have a moment to use a flower crown, I use it, so. I was really happy when you made me look like Callie. And I'm really happy now, too. Next up, hair. I definitely need a new hairstyle. Yes, you do. Yes, you do, girl. Girl, you do. Ooh, okay, I don't have your shirt right now, so we can't talk. <laughs> You're gonna have to wait. You're just gonna have to wait. These two. Like, if I change into something simple, are they going to, is something gonna happen? Cause we already, we already did that. I guess I could try it real quick. I'll just change my outfits really quick. All right, so I just threw on a basic outfit really quickly to see if that's not where they were. To see if anything will happen if I talk to them again. Yes, I've had this conversation. Okay, we already did this. Like, I'm pretty sure I have picture proof that we already did this. This exact thing. What is up with that? Alright, what does it say about this? The Majestic Peony Hall has been in the same family for years and is now open to the public. Okay, but like, is that their way of saying I should go there? Because I'm pretty sure that I went there before and nothing happened. I guess we can try. I'm not sure what their deal is. But we'll go check. Oh, there's the butler. And there's a random person. Yeah, I don't know. I don't know. I'm not sure what's up with that, but... Anyway, I think that's gonna do it for this episode. If you enjoyed it, please give it a thumbs up, share support. Really helps me out. Thank you guys for watching, and I will see you in the next one.